good one. Yeah, buddy. Two and a half. Got a little crayfish down in your crayfish antenna down in your gullet. Nice. Sweet. Thanks for playing. Worried about getting snagged, but I guess you kept that from happening. A little pound and a quarter. Hiding up in the shade. I thought I saw them busting the shed earlier. So. Alright. On the little cotton cordell um, square bill and smoky joe so a lot of shad back here in the creek so i've noticed just big big bundles of them and thought i'd show throw a shad type crankbait see if i get bit working got a hot day today not much wind it's right after labor day i thought i'd come out after the crowds, see if I could find them. Fishing calendar says it's going to be a good day. I'll post that up for you so you can see. And uh, creek's pretty stained. I know the last couple of times I've been back here, it was a lot clearer, but it seems to clear up as you go further back. So hopefully that'll be the case today. But uh, hopefully we'll find them. Not much wind. Pretty much a bluebird sky day. Only good thing is uh, humidity is uh, nice and low, so should be a little more comfortable. But it's going to get up into the upper 90s, so it's still going to be a toasty day. But hopefully they're hiding out in the shade. Like I said, lots of shad in the creek, um, big balls of them. So hopefully we can. find them feeding on some shad and catch us a few today so thanks for coming along checking out the video and we will see what we can do today Fish. Four pounds. Easy. Nice. Ooh. Taking that sweet beaver, it just fell out. Right. Maybe four. Let's wait and see.
three, seven, almost four pounds. Let's get you a drink and then we'll get you some pictures. Oh. Sorry, dude. He came right off that stump. So the squirter bill hit a stump and pulled off of it, and this guy hit it right as he, right as the lure came off the stump. So yeah, these look like maybe smaller fish here in the shallow water. Don't want to get hooked today, dude. Thank you for eating it good. A little half pound dink, but we're having fun. Get you out of there. You tied yourself around that. Yeah, you made me lose my worm. But you sure did nice. Come on, Well, you were hooked good, I'll say that. A little pound bass, but hiding up in the shade, they're fun. Okay, so it looks like the little ones are chasing shad. It seems like the better fish I've caught in the shade off the soft plastics. But, uh, we'll see how the day goes, how things turn out. Just sit still, I'll get this out of your face. Little, little dink. Out in the middle of the creek. 
Oh, this is a white bass. Now that was on the chrome square bill that I switched to in this bright sunshine. Yep, there's another white bass. There's a little school of them right there. Because I saw that school of shad and they look kind of like this black on top and silver on the side. So I thought I would switch to a chrome. The other one in the kind of white and black was working okay too. Dinky white bass, but having fun. It's kind of lucky. Thank you, sir. You done lost an eyeball. Hang on, dude. Pretty deep. Come on, Dave. That's ear tail rattler. been caught before. Thanks for playing. So I feel like we got two patterns going today. One is the fish are chasing Cool as shad. Popping those pretty good. And then we've also got some that seem to be sitting up in the shade, kind of shallow or at least up against the bank. Toss into the shade and find one every now and then. So, makes fishing lots of fun. I like catching them on square bills and I like catching them on soft plastics. It seems like when one style of fishing slows down, the other picks up. But I will say the better fish have come on, um, on the soft plastics today. Something a little. You can white bass. Yep. Look at him spitting up the shad. Ooh, quick release. Here's what they're eating. So you kind of see it looks a lot like a bait. Black on top, kind of silvery side. So. Matching the hatch. That's a nice 
guys you know, he's a little joker but boy that was a sweet hit so that line just thump Oh, dude. Well, I'm getting tired and you're not making it easy. Let's get this out of your face. Little bitty dink. Thank you. All right, it's the day after Labor Day. Got a couple more weeks of summer to go. It was a uh, Hot one here in North Texas uh, today, bluebird skies. Um, got kind of a late start today, fished about six hours, but uh, caught, caught a few fish, uh, kind of a fun day. Uh, two patterns were kind of developing. Uh, one, just tons of uh, pods of shad back here, so uh, some fish were keying on the, uh, the big pods of bait fish, so caught a few on a square bill that, that kind of looked like the shad. Got both white bass and some small um, largemouth. It seems like the smaller fish were keying on the shad. Uh, the other way I was catching them was on uh, soft plastics, uh, Texas rig, and those fish seemed to be bigger. They were kind of hiding up in the shade up against the bank and uh, connected with a couple of nice fish as well as uh, quite a few small fish. But overall, a fun day. Uh, summer's winded down. Bite was kind of tough today, but uh, it was it was fun putting some in the boat with both moving baits and. Um, soft plastic so appreciate you stopping by tuning in checking out the video and we'll catch you on the next one